Hello, <laughs> my name is Gustav, I'm 23 years old and I live in Sweden. One year ago I was still at the university studying to get my bachelor's degree in physiotherapy. And even though I wasn't a big guy, I was in the shape of my life. I was strong, I was explosive and I was healthy. Life was just at the best. But during my last year at the university I was constantly getting weaker in my right side of my body. And to help you guys understand this, I brought out the good old action man. So first I lost my knee control. Uh, so every step I was taking, my knee would just snap back. I couldn't prevent it from hyperextending. And later on, I lost some function in my hand. I lost some overall grip strength, but I also lost the ability to extend my wrist, extend my fingers. And lastly, I lost my ability to dorsiflex, to lift my feet up. <laughs> so I went to see a doctor, and as you might guess from the title of this video, I uh, got diagnosed with MS. MS is a disease which affects your central nervous system, your brain and your spinal cord. And as you might know, these two sends out and receive signals from and to your entire body. So what MS does is actually preventing these signals to travel correctly or travel smoothly due to the scar tissue it leaves on the nerves. The symptoms may vary a lot, but usual symptoms are loss of muscle strength, paralysis, lack of coordination, lack of balance, uh, mental fatigue, etc. And in my case, my symptoms got a lot worse when my body temperature went up. And this is quite common for people with MS that you get intolerant of heat. So here I'm showing you a clip of my hand. <laughs> so this is after a brisk walk. I tried to do some running as well, but I had to stop to relieve my symptoms. some picture of my foot as well. After my first treatment I I got better. But you know some symptoms will not disappear. I mean you can always work on improving your function um, but only to a certain extent. And in order to trying to explain this for you guys I made you this chart. The most common type of MS is the one that comes in attacks or comes in episodes, which means that you rapidly lose function during a period of time. But as these inflammatory processes passes, or these lesions passes, you might regain some function. But now, since the nerves are filled with scar tissues, you won't reach that same level of function as before. So this is where I'm at now, and even though my right side is my dominant side, you can see that my right side is smaller overall. some squats for the first time in many many months and here you can see my orthosis the piece of equipment on my right leg it, it helps me to dorsiflex here i am shoulder pressing and if you pay attention to my leg you can see the tremor that i'm experiencing this happens multiple times a day so i'm quite used, used to it as i mentioned earlier in this video i'm quite sensitive with heat but now I got this bad boy. It is a cooling vest, uh, so it's packed or filled with ice and it, it allows me to be active during a short period of time um, without having the, the same amount of symptoms as I usually have, which is just... Uh, <laughs> 